Hi, my name's Carol, and this is Hummingbird Spot. We're in Colombia looking for another helmet crest. The Los Nevados National Natural Park is 144,000 acres of land right in the middle of Colombia's Central Andes coffee growing district. The area is mostly high altitude Paramo, but there are glacier covered mountain peaks. There are three active volcanoes here and the government of Colombia suggests that you check the volcanic activity before visiting the area. I have always had a fear of volcanoes. I'm not sure why, maybe when I was really little, I saw a movie with flowing lava or something. I'm not really sure, but going to a place where there is a volcano with smoke coming out of it, it's, I'm kind of leery of that to this day. Now, Los Nevados has three active volcanoes. Two of them had minor eruptions in the year 2012. One of them, the Nevada del Ruiz volcano, erupted in 1985 and melted part of the glacier, causing a lahar that flowed down and wiped out the town of Armero, killing 23,000 people. But the territory of the Buffy Helmetcrest hummingbird is almost entirely within this park, in the Paramo surrounding the volcanoes. So when we got to the park that day, the danger level on the volcanoes was yellow on the scale of green to red. So we felt reasonably safe coming to look for the Buffy Helmet Crest. So we drove up to the ranger station and looked out the window and immediately saw a Buffy Helmet Crest right there by the side of the road on the flowers. I was really hoping to get great pictures of this bird on this trip because volcanoes aside, the less time I spend between 12 and 13,000 feet in elevation, the happier I am. This is a rather chunky bird with a short bill and a longer tail. Its primary food source is the small flowering Friley hone plants, and that's where we saw this guy feeding and perching. It has a buffy white collar, a spiky crest, and a beard of green and purple feathers. You know, I still find it hard to wrap my head around the fact that there are hummingbirds that favor this kind of altitude, but this is where they thrive. William Moriana, Steve Sanchez, Johan Flores, and I posed for a picture in front of the sign at the ranger station. Well, I've now photographed three out of four of the helmet crest species. The last one is going to be a bit tricky because the white-bearded helmet crest lives in the mountains of Venezuela. If any of you out there have any ideas how I can get in and out of there, I am all ears. Make sure you subscribe and hit that bell because next Sunday we're going to Termales del Ruiz and you are not going to believe what you see here. See you next Sunday.